When we talk, we often gesture with our hands, even when we can't be seen, such as on the phone. Some studies have linked hand gesturing to intelligence and problem-solving ability, a human trait that spans the planet. Meet some of our closest living relatives, bonobos. They share more than 98% of our DNA and can be found in only one country, the Democratic Republic of Congo, deep in the heart of the Congo Basin. Bonobos are a species of great ape. They're very closely related to chimpanzees. They look very, very similar to them and they have very different aspects to their behavior. Whereas chimpanzees have a very male-dominated society and a very structured hierarchy, bonobos, bonobo females play a much more central role and they have an egalitarian structure. So considering how similar much of their behavior is, there are these subtle differences to bonobo and chimpanzee behavior that make comparisons between the two species really, really interesting. The conditions are rugged and extraordinary. Her fieldwork takes her to the second largest rainforest on Earth. Equipped with her video camera, she's collecting her data, paying close attention to and recording every nuance. I feel incredibly fortunate to have had the opportunity to meet all of the people that I have who have inspired me. I am now 23 years old and working with bonobos and travel to the Democratic Republic of Congo for six months of the year. It's, it's like playing those imagination games when me and my brother were children. It's like, oh, Joe, do you remember when we pretended to be out in the jungle following animals? Now, 15, 20 years later, that's what I'm doing. My research topic is gestural communication. The two goes leaning back. So that means how, how the bonobos are using gestures, how they're using their hands, their, their full limb extensions, even movements of their body to communicate between each other. Specifically, I want to first record all of the gestures. What gesture types are they using? Do males and females use gestures differently? Do they use gestures in combination with facial expressions? Do they use them in combination with vocalizations? And then when I have an idea of the sort of movements that they're using, I would like to understand the meaning of those movements, like creating a dictionary. As a way of giving back, Kirsty offers presentations, sharing her life and research from the community of Wamba where she's based. Proceeds go towards community projects such as a new photocopy facility and a small agricultural startup. In Campbell River, I'm Marjorie Greaves.